Alors Carlos, tu viens de remporter ta demi-finale contre un joueur français issu, issu des qualifications. Uh, I'm going to do it in English because uh, <laughs> maybe it's going to be better. You, you've just uh, beaten uh, Fabien Versailles, uh, um, a player uh, who qualified in the main draw. Um, everyone expected a, a clean win for you because uh, of the ranking difference. Uh, you uh, top 100 uh, and Fabien used to be a pro but not anymore, uh, doesn't play the PSA uh, circuit anymore and uh, it ended up in a big fight, uh, you winning in five games so what are your first impressions? Yeah, I think um, he played really well today, I mean he gave me nothing uh, I was expecting a bit uh, of uh, errors coming from him at the end of the games but he gave me nothing, absolutely anything So all credit to him uh, that he pushed me hard and um, yeah, I, I managed to dig in one more time and uh, yeah, looking forward to, for tomorrow. Yeah, 11, uh, 11 8 in eight, the eight, I think, yeah, yeah, eight. yeah, but I think in the fifth game I was, every time I was uh, yeah. ahead of him, so I was trying to put long rallies and trying to put on some pace, but uh, yeah, he fights, he fights hard and he was fresh because he had no match yesterday, he had no pressure. And all the pressure was on me because I think his job was done already and uh, my job uh, wasn't done because if I lose in the semi-finals there is, is not a uh, good point for me. So yeah, I was trying to concentrate and not to lose the match and finally, yeah, all the hard work pay off. And I was talking to the people, uh, some, some people came up to me and said uh, the match wasn't too good but the refereeing was perfect, excellent quality. Uh, <laughs> there was a lot of talking during that match. Uh, Did that uh, put some pressure on you? Or? Yeah, I think, I think he was trying to do everything to take advantage from it. He, he talked it a lot, he was moving a bit uh, out of the lines, but it's a squash match. At the end of the day, the important is the person who wins. So I'm happy that it's me today. No, the, the referee was, was good today. I think he did a good job. It wasn't that bad. I mean, it's, it's normal. Eh? Two guys fighting for a small place and so happy to win. And, We'll see about so tomorrow you will be back playing uh, seed number one, Angus Gillums. Uh, he told me that uh, you never played each other before. Mm. So uh, what's uh, your expectation on that match? I think we, we've never played each other before and uh, it's going to be tough. But I think if I play well, I have my options. Don't you think uh, that uh, the, the long match, today's long match, uh, physically and uh, mentally, um, you, can you come back strong tomorrow? Yeah, I mean, I mean, the match today wasn't that hard physically because there was so many stopovers, stop and go, stop and go. And uh, it was just a bit mentally, but uh, what, if you win these matches, mentally gives you a bit of confidence for tomorrow. So I'm happy to win and uh, it wasn't that hard physically. Physically, I'm fine, I hope. And uh, so now, uh, eat well. Uh, Good night's sleep. Good night's sleep. And least. come back strong, maybe uh, to win your second, second event Look, in France. Looking forward to it and uh, yeah, thanks, thanks to everyone who supported me tonight because they gave me a bit of confidence and uh, thanks to, to the organization and in your name Nico because you're doing a great job. Okay, well thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you.